Hey guys, welcome back to another Stamping Fun Friday. And I've gone for a cute sort of mermaid inspired um, under the sea um, look today. So if you're interested on how to do this, then just stay tuned. Okay, so starting out, I've just applied two coats of Midnight Swim in CND Shellac to my nails. And it's a really nice colour. It's got sort of like a shimmer running through it anyway. Okay, usual squishy stamper, scraper. This is a Mo U one, this one. Um, I'm going to be stamping in Barry M, and that's in 320 or 350. Foil Effects Gold, and it's a really, really good gold stamping polish, that one. And the plate I'm going to be using is from the Fairy Tale Collection by Mo U London, and it's number 06. And it's this really gorgeous mermaid. And I'm going to be picking bits off of this to put on my nails. And I love this plate. I just love the look of it. It's just really cool. So let's get started. Okay, so I'm going to put her face onto my thumb. Now I've got quite large and long nails at the moment. So this might not fit on everyone's nails, but... That's what I like about these collage plates, is you can just pick random bits off and put them on. So there's her face, really nice. I'm going to try and make her face central like that. And there you go, Let's zoom in on that. Really cute. Okay, so index finger is taken from this area right here. So I want a few seashells and a few scales on there as well. And then squish down, there you go. I love the gold and the blue, I think it looks really, really nice. Okay, middle finger, I'm going to go for this cute seahorse just here. And I love um, anything nautical, actually, on nails. He's very, very cute. So I want to plonk him in the middle and then... There you go. Okay, I'm going to have Mr Jellyfish next on my ring finger. I'm going to put him right in the middle as well. There he is. Okay, and then my pinky, I'm going to take this part here from her tail. And I'm going to try and sort of overlap all three um, designs there, because they're really nice. There you go. And there we are. Okay, so I'll top coat these and show okay, you. So the these end. are the finished nails, and I really think they look really sort of opulent and really rich. Now she reminds me of Ariel, and I think that that plate is so versatile. You could like do a white base and do her hair in the red polish or something. I think it would look really really nice. So have a play if you've got that plate, and um, show me any recreations that you've done. So I'll put all the links to my social networks in the description box and hope you enjoyed this guys and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.